You know, I forgot how fast these Mario videos fly. Oh, and this is... Def... Okay, I was about to say this is definitely Super Mario World 2 music, but... I don't actually... I'm not particularly sure. It's been for friggin' ever since I played those games. I just know all of this music is familiar, and I can't... Remember the specifics of much of any of it. You give me Kirby music. Kirby music I'll recognize. And whoa, I can't. Oh, you can pick him up just like a shy guy in Super Mario World 2. Oh, and it's those orc dudes. What? What is that? What the hell? <laughs> okay then. That's. That's cool. I, I have no idea what- it's just sort of a fire plant. I guess there are lots of fire plants. I was just generally confused as to what the heck that was, but that was pretty awesome. Oh, it's a Snift. Hey, Snift. Bye, Snift. I'll cry for you, Snift. Oh, I got a cake. Excellent. Are these capes even, like, useful for anything? Save me! Um, am I dead? I, I think I might be. Let's rewind! Yay! Can I kill you with this? I can't? That sucks! I can kill those dudes, though. I remember the cape being, like, super kill everything fun time. Which it sort of is, but... I guess it just doesn't kill pokies. Oh, gimme! Oh, I should have used that one up, but whatever. Oh, wow. Do you make lots of fire? It's surprisingly easy to dodge considering how much just draw stuff is shooting out that. That the vol it's like it's sort of like a volcano lotus. But that plant shape is definitely familiar. It's probably ripped from some other game. I bet those dudes hurt you if you touch them. Well, I guess you should assume that everything hurts you when you touch them. That's sort of the point of enemies. Hey, Baba. Health. Ow. Chee-bow-chee. Where? Is that too slow? Point. Oh. One! I won! Yay! Getting one point is even better than getting 50. It's just... That froze there for a second or something. What the? Oh, I see. You got a pipe. Yep. Good night, desert. When was the last time I friggin' used the save state? That's. I don't think I've done that in a bit. And pokies are apparently invulnerable to sniff. It's, it's good to know. Not invinci- Ow. I'm not invincible, certainly. But yeah, I remember killing these guys with. Shells. Ow. I remember killing myself with shells quite fluently. This music is like sort of cool and sort of like whacked out. Oh, and that's gonna be a pain in the butt. Jump, Mario. Ow. Jump. Like, better, Mario. There you go! Good boy. Oh, whoa. That I died for a sec. Ow. Oh, I keep forgetting those cacti. You bump into them. Plink. 
And yeah, this music's just generally weird. Oh, you can't stand on these guys. Huh. Oh, it's another bully. You... There you go. Fall in the sand. It's what you deserve. Hey, Patui. What's going on? Ooh, flower. Fire flower. Uh... Oh, well. Oh! Friggin' perfect. Ow. That's what you get, Mario, for losing my fire flower. What do you mean, I lost it? Friggin' Mar- Up. Oh. That's your fault, Mario. I blame you for that one. Oh. I was spinning! That's crap. Okay, now I'm alive. I like being alive. It's a pretty good feeling. I mean, death probably doesn't have much of a feeling to it. Go down, freaking plumber dude. Ow. You are supposed to keep going back. And that sound is like really out of place. I just definitely object to hearing that as the boomerang noise. Did boomerangs even used to make a noise? I don't know. There just doesn't seem like there would be much of a noise when boomerangs are just going around. Oh! Yes! I just remembered you can do that. You can like slide forward. Or slide uphill slightly. Whoa! Don't kill me, Patui! Flee! Victory! Death! Okay, they, they sort of kill you, but you can also stand them. I get it. Giant pile of bones? They're like lots of dead mammoths. Or giant dead snakes, probably, more likely. But they're just giant rib cages. And why can't I? I can't bump into those blocks. The blocks are a lie. Everything I know is a lie. You can't hit those blocks. I just don't know what's real anymore. Oh, those are real. I know it's real now. Patui is definitely real, and definitely very painful. Ow! And so is that. Everything is painful. Oh, I want what's in there. Life. Oh, it's a thing. Should've known. I saw those cloud thingies, but I didn't think it would be a vine. I didn't think about it being a vine, actually. Ah, got ya. Freaking hammer bros. Hey, the blue shell guy. I like you, blue shell guy. Oh, blue shell guy, you betrayed me! Blue shell guy. I thought we had a connection. Oh, red shell guy. Now, I knew you were a jerk. I've always known that. It's like, in your biography. Your biography is just, I'm a jerk. One sentence. Oh. Come on. I just wanna, yeah, there we go. Stand right next to Patui. Oh god. Stand right next to Fiery Death. And, ow. More Fiery Death. That. Okay, I'm not safe anywhere. Perfect! Sort of. Perfect after two tries. That's very much not perfect, really. And we win! I forgot to get one point this time, though. I should try to do that on every level. I definitely wouldn't remember to do that, though. And onward to the fortress, I think. Yep. Oh, nope. There's a level between there. There's been very level... Very few secret levels in this hack, which I actually kind of like, honestly. Getting secret exits is sort of a pain. If you watch uh, SSOH CK, I think that's his full name. 
long names like that, or hard to remember names like that, is why I wanted to change my old YouTube name. Anyway, if you watch that guy, you probably know his his status is that he doesn't want to ever get any secrets, basically. Which I'm I'm okay with getting switch balances, I guess. But uh, I jumped on that. I stomped on that fish again. But that one time I tried it, it wouldn't work. Whatever. And I do like that this... The underground is at least repalleted. I know pallet swapping is sort of like looked down upon as making... You know, artificial variation because you're just taking... Sprites you already made and recoloring them, but... It really adds variety and... It's definitely a lot nicer than, you know, not palette swapping anything. And just not having any variety. Anyway. I think I've talked about palette swapping before. I've also talked about how swimming water up waterfalls is not particularly possible for humans. Oh. I fail at A-coins. Thanks, Arrow. That that was helpful. I would have never gone to go, never known to go down if it weren't for you and gravity. Mostly gravity, but you helped too. I keep forgetting to slide. Oh, and whoa, got some like 3D ishness here. That's neat. Oh. What the? <laughs> Weird. Why do I make the dewy sound? Oh. Do you always make that in water? If you do, I've totally not noticed that. I only noticed that when I was doing that in the lava. Oh. Brilliant. Double brilliant. Not the best at... I mean, I don't like blind jumps, but at the same time, I should, like, be more careful when I know there's a blind jump, but... Whatever. Oh, and I can get a crap ton of shrooms here. That, and the shrooms float slower in water. That's neat. That's neat, you can, like, fully reheal yourself here. Oh, sweetness, I gotta... I gotta get into that thing, there. I'm not sure what to call this, this waterfall, like, tunnel. That's just neat. Oh! Well, I don't really care. One point! Oh, two points. I lose. I lose at losing. Sniff. Oh well. It's so funny that he keeps walking to the wall. I think in Super Mario World, he usually walks off-screen. And this is some... desert music right here. Well, sort of. It's more deserty than some of the other ones have been. Not particularly sure how you can quantify something as deserty, but... If you could, this would be like... A 7... Or a 6 on the scale of deserty. An eight if you're feeling generous, maybe. Fire! Gotta love fire. And, oh. It's not a dead end. There's a door. Oh! And we're almost out of time. So next episode, we'll continue into this ghost house looking thing. And kill more dry bones. Thanks for watching! <laughs>